Congratulations, Jalango. Uh, we have seen uh, results that are indicating that you are the MP elect of Kanata. Uh, what do you have to say about it as we wait for the official uh, announcement? Just like you've said, the official announcement is what will make it official. But we thank everybody who came out to vote. And before I speak, let me give uh, a willy who we were competing with to also say a word before I say something. Members, members of the press, ladies and gentlemen, how are you? <clears throat> like you've heard, uh, I'm standing next to MP elect Langata. I was uh, vying as an independent candidate and uh, we want to change the way we do our politics. Uh, we've agreed that uh, we're going to work with our incoming member of parliament because Langata is bigger than all of us and we mean well for Langata. I want to say that uh, all of us across leadership, if I may speak for them, we've all agreed that Tomunga Mkono Jalango we are grateful for the peaceful uh, election we've gone through. IBC, it's taking long to do the tally, the announcement which is just procedural and legally it has to be done. But we know Jalas is the hashtag 13th uh, member of parliament of Langata. So for me, Tom Awili, I'll say that I'll support you Jalango. Thank you. Uh, we will not uh, oppose you, but we will watch and work together. Thank you. Sasao, Asantene. And of course, yes, Awil is here because even before this competition had got gotten this far, uh, there's a lot I need to learn from him as a, as a as a brother, as an elder brother, father figure in Langata. Him who's lived in Langata more than 40 years, born and bred here. Definitely, I'm from the village, so I'll be getting a lot of guidance from somebody like Awili and uh, any other you're welcome any other person who we were competing with even uh Bana Korir, so that we can also go on with a good job that he was doing uh we don't want to leave anybody out because this thing is not about jalas it's about langata and uh, that is where we are and uh, for now we shall just wait for the procedure to go on it's procedural what is going on there and it might take long uh, this could easily go until tomorrow, 3 p.m., yes. around 19 hours left. And it's good, there's no tension. Everything there's no tension, okay. everything is okay. This is a very, very mm. well-organized election, especially for Langata. I thank the residents, I thank the youth and the women, Yes. and uh, all our supporters. Thank you. Okay. Mm. Uh, it's a very mature thing to do any time after an election but at the end of the day his uh, congratulations will mean a lot immediately we are announced as winners uh, but it's always a good to have mature leaders like him and we appreciate him for that because of that selflessness is why we are having peaceful moments here because if he had decided to to go all the way and not accept where we are with the results that we already telling. He had his telling center, I had my telling center, and they're looking good on our side. But uh, with that pronouncement, it has given us a lot of peace here. Unaona leo, hakuna polisi. I can remember the last time we were here. Police were guarding this place. All over, there was police all over. What wana pig, what wapi, nini. But we are here just waiting for the procedures to go on. Yeah. Jalango as well, uh, we, we are seeing Kenyans are waiting for the national tally. Mm. I don't know what message could you have for Kenyans and uh, from both your party and the other. All I can say is that they be calm as we wait for the announcement of Baba the Fifth. I want to take this opportunity, an early opportunity to con congratulate President elect Raila Molodinga. Uh, he's going to be the commander in chief. What a better time! to go to parliament when Baba is the president. So, yeah. <laughs> I know really would have wanted to go now, but with Baba coming in uh, as a fifth president of the Republic of Kenya, it makes even going to parliament better. And what even makes it much better is that I've, I've been blessed to step in his shoes. This is where he was a member of parliament. And uh, what a better time also that uh, your mentor, your father, is going to be the president and you are a member of parliament of his bedroom. Langata is actually Baba's bedroom, not Kibra, 
want to make sure that people know that Baba lives here in Karen yes. and you sleep in your bedroom. Yes, so we don't know what Kebra is. Okay, yeah. I have two questions for you. Number one, uh, to know that was a new one came through to Bongeza the music in the Kale. The likes of Rington and Kwa, there was a new one. How does that make you feel in number two? Are you maybe planning to work with other artists when you're away like Kenna DNG, Kodida? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, art is what has given me the chance to be here where I am today. Is the reason why all of you are interviewing me today. So if you're a young man in Langata who's ever wanted to pursue something in the creative industry, this is going to be a better chance for you because your member of parliament is born bred in the creative industry. So it's going to be a big thing. Uh, for the big other things, uh, I have good mentors. I have a Kinawili here who we'll be working with closely to make sure that we push Langata. And to all the other artists who had also joined politics and uh, congratulations to them. Uh, I've called most of them. Uh, unfortunately, JC lost in Imenti and they really wanted, we've already spoken and uh, he will give it another chance. This is a chance to dare, to dream. Uh, it is not about us, it's about giving hopes to people who look up to us in the creative industry. Yes. Your message to Kenyans as what county Peace, 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 peace. IBC have the final tally and they will announce Raila Amolo Odinga as the fifth president. But for now, be calm. I want you guys to save this video now. Raila Molodinga is the fifth president of the Republic of Kenya. Save that one for use on a Friday. Do not release that part of this video now. <laughs> release it on Friday. That Jalango actually predicted Raila's presidency. Yes. Okay, Ma Jalango, congratulations on your victory. Uh, second is that uh, now I have one question uh, regarding the residents of Lanata. My question is, can you share with us maybe the first thing you consider to do for the like, residents, residents of Lanata? The first thing we consider to do is to first go back and start a series of town halls with the opinion leaders. All right, opinion leaders and everybody that we competed with so that we can come together uh, post-election meetings. We are not the kind of leaders who come and tell you what we will do. We call it participatory leadership in community development, where you go back to the people and ask them, what are the needs, what do we do, what do we start with? So we will have a series of town hall meetings with elders, opinion leaders, and residents of Langata, so that we are able to know the direction that we want to take Langata to. But most importantly,